imagine with me cause you merit it. Imagine that you are under a big sun in a never ending expanse of desert. You have been walking for hours and hours. Looking up, you suddenly spot something in the sense. A sparkly lake. You rub your eyes, it's still there. You run and run, but only for the world melt into the air. How is for me? If you have the same curiosity, focus with me. I'm Shima Radios, and in this video, I'm going to explain you this phenomenon. After my research, I know that much is an optical illusion that has fooled meters caused by atmospheric conditions, especially the appearance of a body of water in a desert or a hot road caused by the refraction of light. But what's refraction of light? In physics, refraction is a change in direction of a wave passing from one medium to another. To better understand, I will use this experiment. In a cup of water, we try to answer a pencil. We notice that the pencil is broken. But that's only an illusion, cause the refractive index of water is greater than this one in air. That's what's called refraction of light. Let's move on. For a mirror to occur, we will need the ground. That a thin layer of hot air just above it. Since just above that, the air will need to be cold. These two temperatures cause light to refract. But how? To know how, one must first know how light travels through air. If the temperature is the same, light travels through it in a straight line. But if the temperature changes, however, light will follow a curved path. Just like when a car will stop after a high speed. Cold air is denser than warm air. So when gases warm up, the atoms move faster, spread out, and rise. That's why steam coming from a pot of boiling water always goes upward. But when the air is colder, the gases get slower and close together, and therefore this one has a greater refractive index. So, when the density rises, the refractive index rises too. When the light passes through these two layers, it will form a U shape. Even though its light rays are red, but our rays still see them as rays. That was caused us to see a mirror image that looks like water because water refracts what's above it. This mirage is called inferior mirage. There are also other types, like Vira Morgana. If you want to understand them, search. Our knowledge is a receding mirage in an expanded desert of economics. And keep in mind the code of real soccer. There are light is a light, and there are lights, and you are one of the lights, the light of all the lights.